Hey everyone, welcome to another one in Phasmophobia. We're gonna figure out the ghost together with zero evidence. I'm gonna try to show you how to figure out the ghost. And I'm also going for perfect games. <laughs> My game was frozen for a second. Okay. Okay, so breakers in the garage, uh, we're gonna hop in, oh my god, it's snowing, which means thermal's gonna be useless for the first five minutes. And yeah, I'm gonna show you how to figure out the ghost with zero evidence. So, let's figure out that ghost. No hiding spot here. Turn these on. Turn you on. Okay, my favorite hiding spot is available. I was about to say there's a bone. Oh, there's actually a bone. Nice, we got the bone. We can maybe go for the perfect game then. I mean, the thermal is going to be useless, right? <laughs> so, yeah, let's just set up a tiny ghost highway already. Why am I taking the EMF? I wanted to place it at the breaker because for the gin testing. Okay, how do I take those? You know what? I'm gonna do it like that. Okay, you are right in front of me. Interesting. Let's take care of bony pants. If it starts hunting now, I can just hide. <laughs> okay, ghost is around this area here. Interesting. Mm, let's grab you. Set up the ghost highway for now. Because we can't use the thermal yet. Okay, let's leave that at the breaker for gin testing. You're gonna stay here. Okay, touch this door here. Which means could be here, could be here, could be there. So now uh, we're gonna try to figure out where Ghost of Pants is at. One, two, three. Let's leave that here. Leave another one at the hiding spot in case it's a stalky ghosty like a banshee or a phantom or a wraith. Maybe it's actually a stalky ghosty, maybe it's in the basement, we don't know. So I hope the Thames are okay now. Came out of the garage, walked all the way to the door. Yeah, you are here. Okay. Let's see, how cold is it here? The kitchen is quite cold. How is the garage? Uh, that's the problem with snow weather. As you can see, the thermal is not that reliable. Kitchen seems to be colder, but it's because of the snow weather outside. It's cold everywhere. So what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna put you here. Put you here. And put those. Let's leave those here for later. I'm gonna put you over here. I'm gonna test for Phantom over here and Banshee for the stalky ghosties. Okay. Okay. That was turning off the breaker. Oh, I hope it counts like that if I'm taking the photo up close. Yeah, it does. No gin and uh, no weight. <laughs> okay, you've stepped into this one. You are all over the place, Mr. or Miss. Now you're there? What the? Okay, this ghost is a little bit weird. Still don't know where it's at. that here 
Oh, we also have to test for Onryo, of course. Okay, I wanted to take a picture, but I wasn't able to grab the cam. Damn it. We've touched this door, okay. You are all over the place, Ghosty. You're not making it easy. This door is still open, okay. Don't see an orb here. Let's place it so we can see the doors. Okay, it's walking back and forth over here. Okay, let's put you over here in case you are an Unreal. Um, what the heck? You are everywhere! What the heck, Ghosty? 2.7. Come on, Thames. Okay, you're not in here, that's for sure. Are you in the kitchen after all? Okay, 2.1. And here is 11. Okay, you are in the kitchen. Nice. Now let's try to get some photos. So we've already taken this one. This is for later, for the testing. And this is for photos. Okay, let's set up that hiding spot. We're gonna need this, we're gonna need a cam, a photo cam. I'm gonna put this uh, around the car, so I can see in here too. Photo cam. I should have grabbed the power ball as well. See that? That's roaming towards my location here. You see that? It roamed towards my location. So I think we might be dealing with a phantom or banshee. Maybe. Let's leave that cam here for this perspective. At least I got this feeling. So it's not a wraith for sure because it has stepped into the salt. That's obvious. So we don't need an EMF here. We can leave it there. That's okay. Okay, we're gonna need this, this. We can use the UE to see where the ghost is roaming to because I use it all the times to see if it roams towards my location. Whoa, that scared me. Okay, you might have roamed to my location again, twice. You, Are you a banshee? Might actually be a banshee. So we got the bone already, which is nice. Okay, let's test it. Let's just sit here in case it shows up. There's another ghost event. We're gonna grab the cam. It's right here. We have to grab it in time. We got salt there. We got a sensor here. We got another sensor there. So this ghost is quite roamy and it walked towards my location twice. It could have been roaming because I was in the ghost room. Might have been a coincidence. Maybe it's just roaming around. We got a footstep. Okay, are you gonna walk towards me? So, for now we can say not a wraith, not a djinn, that's all we know. We have to check for orbs later, that's why I set up the camps like that. Wait, did you just... I just stepped into the salt. But you're not coming this way, huh? So if you're testing for Banshee and Phantom, if you don't know if it's a Banshee or Phantom, you better be sitting on a crucifix. You're flickering those lights a lot, but that doesn't mean anything. It also doesn't mean any anything if it does a lot of light breaking ghost events or singing ghost events or turning off the breaker. It's just random chance. Don't rely on that, please. Don't, don't rely on that. Okay. You're not roaming towards me, but 
When you stepped into the salt, it felt like you were walking towards me. Maybe it's a phantom. A phantom is not that likely to stalk you. Maybe Ghostly was just curious what I've been doing. <laughs> Could be possible. Okay, no huge reactions to the candles, no huge reactions to the lights yet. It's still here, it's still walking around in here. Okay, let's turn those lights off. I'm gonna turn them back on later. Because I wanna test for mare as well. Maybe we're gonna see the mare ability. And I'm gonna bring in another candle. I'm gonna check the sanity because for mare I'm gonna try to stay at about 60% to test for mare. Okay, now that I've turned off the lights, the activity increases, okay? Any orbies? We see snowflakes, yeah. Doors look normal, this is snow. No orbies, okay. Now you're doing a lot of stuff. Sanity is still fine. So let's bring in those candles to test for Unreal and let's turn those lights back on. Let's see if there's any reaction to this. Here, one for you. Oh, also we have to set up for Poltergeist, of course. Okay, no reactions to the lights yet. Nope, okay. Whoa, you scared the living shit out of me, mister. There you go, light breaking event. And everyone is gonna be like, what? What are you, you're doing so much stuff at once, blowing out the candles, throwing stuff, what? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let me check that throw. I wanted to set up for poltergeist. Oof, now it all happened so quick. Feels territorial, that ghost. Let's see. Um, we won't get EMF5 here. Because we don't have any evidence that could have been a multi-throw. Maybe of two items or three items. Maybe four items with EMF1 each. Could be possible. Oh, now that piece of shit has broken the lights and I wanted to set up the stuff. Damn it. And I thought it was hunting. It scared the shit out of me. Okay, now you're throwing. Wait, did you throw that? That's quite a far throw. Yeah, you've thrown that. If a ghost throws a lot, it doesn't mean necessarily that it's a poltergeist. If a ghost uh, touches the doors a lot, it doesn't mean that's a uh, UA. You've touched the breaker box! You are everywhere! Are you a twin? Might be a twin. You see that? It's that looked like a UA ability, but it didn't sound like it. I need more stuff for poltergeist because I'm gonna drag the ghost down that lane here this is our ghost highway <coughs> and I'm gonna s look how much it's gonna be thrown and I'm gonna try to look at the ghost what willows you've thrown willows toy all the way from over here to over there in one seriously this, this must be I mean, it could be twins, too. Ghosty, now you're starting over, huh? Yeah, you've thrown that again. Would you? Oh my god, you're going crazy. What the heck is going on? This ghost is going insane. Okay, we don't have anything left on our hands. Okay, that's actually weird. Okay, let's leave the doors like that for you, eh? 
I have to look at that bot because maybe it's poltergeist, maybe it's twins. Maybe that EMF4 we have seen was a twin direction that was too fast for it to recognize. Okay, that's almost a twin direction, but not for sure. Come on, give me a twin direction. I think we're gonna hop in and watch it for a while, but I have to be careful. I mustn't be ton. There you go. That's a poltergeist. We got a poltergeist, guys. Oh my god, did you? Oh no, it messed up my ghost highway, I think. Be careful. If you're dealing with a poltergeist and a poltergeist does a multi throw, then uh, it drains your sanity per item, I think 2% or something like that. What did you mess up? Where? Damn it. Damn it. Where's my other cam? Gimme, gimme, gimme. There you are. I gotcha. Okay, what has been messed up? Um, this looks normal. My god, these are some heavy throws. What have you been doing? Would you please cut that out? It did something. It messed up s something in the room, but I don't know where. Oh, now it's going crazy. going crazy on the knife you want to stab me huh mini ghosty don't you dare stabbing me i'm gonna step back i'm gonna grab the knife i'm gonna stab you ghosty pants where why is that cup out of the line ghosty stop destroying my constructions you are insane with those candles would you please leave them on since you've broken the lights here i have to see some shit Wait a second, what's lying over here? Oh my god, you did an explosion in here? I don't have a smudge on me, that's stupid. Yeah, it did an explosion here, you see that? The items are everywhere. Come on, give us a poltergeist explosion. Come on, give it to us, show it to us. Um, come on, do it in your room. I'm gonna concentrate all the items over here, even if I have to bring those one by one. You can also have a look at uh, this pal here later, after the hunt, because it's gonna sound crazy if we drag that ghost over here. Uh, a little bit further like this, because of the flashlight. Okay. It's gonna throw that stuff like crazy if I drag that ghost down this lane. This is our ghost highway and gonna explode everything okay ghost come on i i set up a little playground for you so you can have some fun go ahead and have fun no 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 no! i want to be around it i'm just looking for more items for you to play with give me a sec oh we got another cup why did you have to break those lights okay it won't be a deochen so i can don't you dare! God damn it! Stupid airballs, I hate them, it's gonna hunt soon. Okay, let's put this here so we can see something. Let's open this. It feels like this... Are you a twin or a poltergeist? I have to be sure. I mean, during a hunt I can figure that out. So that's... That's a ghost you can figure out either way. During a hunt... Or outside of a hunt. Oh, that's the phone I've thrown for you. Okay, Ghosty, you are right there. Go ahead, have fun with that stuff. It's all yours. <laughs> yeah! Right on time, thank you. I mean, you didn't throw everything. I'm a little bit disappointed, but hey, it's okay. Did you see that? That was a poltergeist multi-throw and yeah, yeah, you're you're about to hunt, I know, because my sanity is fucked now, because it has thrown so much. So that's a true poltergeist you're seeing right here. That's a true poltergeist. I don't know where all that stuff went. I'm trying to collect it back. <laughs> oh my god, you even went all the way into my ghost highway. You little meanie. 
You've destroyed my highway. Why? It has destroyed my highway, guys. My ghost highway. Ghosty! Okay, leave that here. Come on, Ghosty. You can go ahead and hunt now if you like to. I won't find the west because it's just so damn dark here. It has <coughs> broken those lights. Don't make the items lie on top of them. Where's that stupid knife? Would you please stop it with the knife and with the breaker? Where's that knife? Play with the items I've provided you. Where's the knife? Damn it. It's gonna hunt. Oh my god, it keeps throwing stuff that is... No, no, no! Get over here! Get over here! Over here! Over here. Try to hunt here. Go back. Go back. Go back. Good. That's why I use the sensors. I know exactly where the ghost is gonna be at. Okay, um, yeah, leave this highway. It's okay. We're gonna add you to the front. <coughs> You've been promoted now, look at this. Ghosty here! Hey, 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 hey! Here! This way! Listen! I'm here! Look at the throws. See that? Hey! Here! Are you blind? Hey! Hey! Sorry guys, that's the stupidest poltergeist alive. Oh my god, you're messing up the basement, you hear that? Hey, I'm here! Yeah, of course. Of course it was too stupid to find me. Okay. Nope. At least you were able to see some throws. I just want to show you the throws doing a hunt. Don't destroy any everything again. Because you'll... Oh my god, don't put your stuff in my face! Ugh, gross! Wait, I'm not ready! Hey! Ah, oh, damn it. That was just another event that sounded like a hunt. Um, breakers on. Nah, damn it. My sanity should be fucked by now. <laughs> okay. <sighs> Leave those candles alone. I don't see shit. Okay, let's see. We got enough lights here. So let's hope. You're gonna see it. Let's hope Ghosty is gonna find us. I mean, I've put some sensors over here. So we're gonna see it too if it comes this way. And remember the way they are lying now? And then after the hunt... No, don't destroy my piles. And after the hunt you can check them if you are too scared to watch it doing that. Hey, 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 hey! Here, here, here! Ghosty over here! This way! Now look at them. See that? You saw that cup flying all the way up to the ceiling? <laughs> Go away. Don't you dare! And yeah, our line, our... Do you see that? It yeeted those corks all the way over here and one of those w was lying here. I remember this and another one was here. You see that? That's a true poltergeist. So if you don't wanna look at it during done, try to lure it uh, this way without it seeing you like screaming on this corner, then go and hide. Have a smudge on you just in case. And look at your line after the hunt. And if it's like this, you see it, it has been destroyed completely. Show us, give us a sign. Now the activity is increased. Oh, and by the way, these doors, you heard that? They have been closed, all three of them, because of that event. After the event, every door that has an EMF2 on the, them, you can take a picture of those. You can take a picture of the ghost, and see, EMF2, picture, and these one didn't count, these ones, okay. But yeah, just a little hint for you guys. Look at the door that has EMF2. You can take an additional picture of that if you're going for perfect games and if you got a ghost event like that. Just wait for the ghost event to finish. Take a picture of the ghost. And uh, after it has been finished, that was the ghost event, by the way. 
You can take a picture of the door. Okay, we got the burn. We got a perfect game. Nice. So, this was a poltergeist. Be careful. Sometimes you can confuse poltergeist and twins because twins throw stuff back to back sometimes. And you might think it's a poltergeist because the main twin throws an item while it's flying in the air. The decoy could interact with it doing that. Do the twin interaction and it flies even further because it eats it while it's in the air. And uh, yeah, then you could think, oh, that was a foul throw. That could have been a poltergeist throw. So try it out doing the hunt like I did and try it out outside of a hunt using a pile and check your sanity after that. You will know and you can check this. Of course, if you don't have those monitors, yeah, whip. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> I play with those all the time because I don't want to do math and I love that activity monitor because it gives away poltergeist and twins. It helps a lot. So be careful not to confuse those two. And yeah. So I didn't even have to check for an orb because a mimic uh, changes ghost type every one to two minutes. And um, yeah, it did it. It did this behavior during the hunt. It did the poltergeist explosion about two or three minutes before that. So then it would have been a mimic mimicking a poltergeist twice or even three times, which is almost or nearly impossible. So yeah. And it used its ability five times so that EMF4 we saw on that activity board, it was, I think, yeah, it was uh, in that hallway, those items, because we checked that, right? It was a book. I think there was another book and two pictures. And it's random. The EMF reading is random. Sometimes an item being thrown gives EMF1, sometimes two or three. In this case, I think every item was an EMF1. It was random. And that's why it looked like an EMF4 spike on the activity board. So keep in mind, if you're playing on zero evidence, you will never see an EMF4 or 5 spike on that activity board. Except it's a poltergeist multi-throw, a fast, really fast twin interaction or a ghost event. So yeah. I hope that helps you to figure out the poltergeist with zero pieces of evidence and I hope you liked it. See you in the next one. Bye!